If you haven't seen the first part of me taking the sugar bear hair for six months, I highly recommend that you do. In that video, I've been giving a quick synopsis of each month and guiding you through the process journey. Now, with that said and done, let's hop on to the final six months of the sugar bear hair journey and figure out once and for all, does this shit work or not? Because people want to know. And I know you're busy, so let's get started. Oh shit, that's right, quick disclaimer. So unlike the other video where I gave a quick synopsis at the end of the month, in this video, I didn't do that. I just went straight to the end of the sixth month to give a final thoughts and reviews on the Sugar Baby Hair product. So with that being said and done, let's roll the clips. Good morning, guys. As you can see, I combed out the whole hair out so you can see the roots of how it's been growing out over the past year by taking Sugar Bear hair, bars, Put me as the best rapper alive, I dare you. If you notice, I don't know why the hell I have so much freaking lint in my head. The dangling hair that was growing out of my head is almost gone. It was shredded off, thanks to the brush that they sent. Yo, that detangle brush that they have works wonders. It got rid of most of the dead hair. Yeah, my hair's slowly getting back to normal. But one thing I didn't like about taking the whole thing for a year, even though I felt like it did grow my hair, it grew hairs in other places where I didn't want it to grow, if you catch what I'm saying. For example, my face. I've been feeling like I've been shaving a lot frequently compared to days before I even start taking it. Now keep in mind, if my hair wasn't as mostly dead at the beginning of this experiment, my hair would have been a lot longer, not looking like a bum. Now, if you excuse me, I'm going to go and fix this son of a gun and show you what it looks like when it's normal. And this looks like when I'm a human being and not a bum, when my hair is fully washed and conditioned. Now notice the uh, the roots of my hair is overpowering the blonde. Dead hairs that was dangling from the bottom prior, most of it is all gone. And you can actually start seeing the curls of my hair starting to take form again, which is absolutely fantastic because that's what I needed. I love my curls. Why would I ever want to do something to damage it? Either way, I hope this sheds some type of light into your decision whether or not if you want to try Sugar Bear hair or not. For me, I think it worked. I think my hair would have been a lot longer. I think my hair would have been up to here by now and the back would have been a little bit more puffy if I didn't have any, where the fuck are these flies keep coming from? If I didn't damage my hair prior and yeah, but we're not gonna talk about that. The point is, does it work, yes or no? I said yes. But do not take my word for it. I would encourage you to do more research on the topic to figure out whether or not if you want to take it or not. This is just someone else's opinion and I don't want my opinion to reflect your decision. So definitely do more research on the product and see whether or not if it's a choice for you.